the Pearl Harbor submarines. Like I said, in 1930, basically, I had these submarines. I had to use them at my sub base in, um, in Germany. And um, they were training subs. Then they were worn out after they had 120,000 hours on them. The Brio shells were leaking like crazy, so I sold them to a private party, supposedly a movie producer or someone. <clears throat> it was actually the Republican Party. So anyway, so they're leaking like crazy, and they say, and they say, well, we'll pay full price, or whatever. I I sold them to them for like ninety thousand dollars a piece or something like that. Sold them like like two or three of them. So anyway, the repair on it, it's like one hundred twenty thousand dollars though, or something like that. So we charge them and we do it and I throw in a paint job and then and then I think someone they end up getting charged two hundred fifty thousand dollars a piece for the submarines. So anyway, so and then they don't have the money for them because they're buying like a million dollars worth of submarines, but they don't have the money for them. They don't even have the money to pay for the parts for the repair at the place. So I'm like, well, maybe I'll rent them out or something like that. I've already done the repair or something like that. So we actually put them as the as submarine museum for, for, for day use and rental in Pearl Harbor. They're pleasure submarines. So then they go out, and supposedly they're supposed to be on a war mission. They go over to J J Japan, and this is the one that I really want to tell you about, is the um, is is they shoot at a sub at, at a ship, or, or they think they hear a ship, they don't know where they are, and they shoot in a direction. The torpedo goes four or five miles and goes into by the by the harbor. It hits a ferry boat carrying nothing but but but, but preschool children. There are three schools that pulled their money to go on a ferry ride. Three schools. There's nothing but 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 like two hundred and like like a couple hundred thousand like a couple thousand children on that ferry boat. They had saved up their money. The parents had given them money to go on that ferry boat ride. They planned it for three months or six months beforehand. Those piece of shit, nineteen twenty five from Pearl Harbor people, they take the submarines out there. They don't even have the money. For the fucking submarines. They can't even afford the fucking rental. They load a $3,000 torpedo into those fucking submarines. They go to Japan. And then they fire one off. They think there's a ship in front of them, but they're not sure. So they just fire one. It hits the ferry. Every single child dies. They're five to six year old children. They just wanted to go see the ocean. <sighs> There's not enough teachers to, there weren't enough life vests and there weren't enough teachers. Somebody says they're only Japs. Like I said, those every single one of those submarine people from 1930 should be taken out back and shot. I wanted their head. I wanted them put in prison forever. I will never forgive what they did. Anyway... It was like $300 a ticket or, or $70 a ticket. The children had worked forever for six months to save money picking up trash to go on that fucking ferry ride. Those pieces of shit shouldn't even have been near there. But they said, oh well, it's day use and if we drive during the day... Will only be charged for day use. So they go all the way, they refuel, they make it all the way to Japan. 
and then they fire off a torpedo. The precipitator torpedoes are only supposed to go four miles, but they can actually go four and a half or five and a half. It somehow makes it all the way. They say it was six. It was actually six miles from where they actually were, underwater hiding like cowards. It goes six miles and makes it right to that fucking ferry boat. Dink. And boom. Every single one of them except for maybe 36 children die. They were five years old. They didn't know how to swim. They had never even seen the ocean before. Are you proud to be a be a Republican? <laughs> there was no war. Just some fucking pieces of shit doing piracy and shooting and trying to make themselves rich or something and shooting off torpedoes with one of my rebuilt submarines that I had allowed to be in the water and even given a paint job to and actually even paid for the fucking repair on. And that's on me. It was my shop that repaired this, the submarine. I had painted them. They were listed as museum rental, day use only. Civilian, private party. They were not military. They had nothing to do with the government. And they couldn't even afford the fuel. Proud to be American, you say? Um, don't really know. I wouldn't necessarily call them Americans. Technically, those are Republicans, Confederate pieces of shit there. that were spending money and in submarines they couldn't afford and that were over 70 or 150 years old and considered relics and museum pieces, trying to say that they were glorified and something about to do with fighting for the, for the rights of their country or some shit. Anyway. I have to live with what I, with my decisions. Apparently they don't think they have to live with theirs. I don't really know what they've been through though. 